Hi friends, Vegan Nessie here where you learn how to cook, speak Tagalog and have some fun. Today, we will going to turn this squash into a fancy meal using quinoa and other good stuff. So let's get started. Yay! So we're, we are going to need two acorn squash. There you go. Ta-da! What's that? Oh. You need to have a good knife when you're cutting a squash. There you go. Ooh, that was a struggle. And then you have you have to remove the seeds, of course. If you have little helpers, you can let them help. Good job. Okay, take that out. Yo, I can feel smushy. <laughs> okay, remove that. Oh, do I really have to remove it? <laughs> so just scrape it properly. Now we have the squash all clean. We are going to make our sauce. Orange juice sauce. With all your might. Okay, good job. It's okay. Can I try now? You know, both kids need to try. They like to help. <laughs> <laughs> all right, okay. That's good. Can you eat That's good. We will need uh, six tablespoons of out of that orange orange juice that we just squeezed. If you don't have a fresh orange juice, of course you can buy an orange, a pre-made orange juice. Now I was lost again. You're three. Three. <laughs> Four and five. I thought you said six. Ooh. Oh, six. <laughs> See. See how the kids are a great help for you? Okay, so six tablespoons of orange juice, one tablespoon of balsamic vinegar. I use aged balsamic vinegar. And one tablespoon of olive oil. If you don't want, if you want it to be uh, less oil, you don't have to put the oil, it's optional. Just, I know some of us wants to avoid oil, so you don't have to put the oil in. First, we're going to warm up the oven to 350. Now we're just gonna put it here and brush it with the, the dressing that we have. No, you do it. Paint away. <laughs> so just make sure you brush it evenly. That and then we're gonna put sprinkle it with salt and pepper. All right. The leftover we're going to use that later. Oh my salt. goodness! Not so much salt. Okay. There's none in here. <laughs> We're done. Bad. <laughs> so, <laughs> oh, okay, it's salt and pepper up now. Yeah. So we have our pumpkin seeds here. One fourth cup of pumpkin seed. We're gonna toast it together with a squash. This is for topping later. And just put uh, at least one. Um, just um, cover it with a little bit of the orange balsamic dressing. All right, and we'll just spread it. Okay, let's put it. Oops, it's hot. Hot, 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 hot. hot, hot. Okay, I will help you. Okay, we'll just put it in the middle. You have to be very careful with the kids when they're helping you. So that's uh, put it in the middle. And here is the pumpkin seeds. Remember to check the pumpkin seeds after six minutes because you don't want that to get burned. The squash, you are going to bake for 40 minutes. 350 for 40 minutes. And six minutes is over. You just have to mix it. And let's put it back and cook it for another two minutes. And that's it. Well and toasted. So uh, I made a mistake. Instead of cooking the squash upside down, I put it right side up. So I flip it like this and put it back again. Now that the squash is cooking, we are going to cook the quinoa. This is one cup of quinoa. We're going to rinse and drain. Now that you see the water is clear, you just have to drain it very well. Just put one half teaspoon of grapeseed oil. 
if you want to know how to cook a quinoa like a pro just watch one of my shorts now it's hot a little bit of salt and pepper just cook it for a little bit one minute one cup of water remember one cup of water one cup of quinoa is the perfect proportion for cooking a perfect quinoa cover and bring it to boil once boiled lower it to a simmer and cook for 15 minutes once 15 minutes is done remove it from the stove top and just flap it look how perfect that is and just pull it down and this is done sure it's a brown like golden brown here on the side and it's soft and make sure when you poke it it goes through it's soft so that's it we're just gonna put it aside for the quinoa Heat the pan put half a teaspoon of grape seed oil half a cup of chopped red onion one cup of chopped celery i cube that now you can mix it enough. There, it's more sizzling. Mm -hmm. Let's cook this for four minutes. How's it going, Chef? Good. Do you think you can do this? I'm sure. A third cup, a third cup of pumpkin seeds. You can add that now. And mix. Cook for three minutes. Oof. This is the cooked quinoa. You can add the quinoa. Half a cup of chopped uh, dried cranberries. <laughs> I have to take three more. Three more? Are you sure you're going to cook it or uh, pour it right to your mouth? I'll put all of it in my mouth. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay. That's not one third anymore, but you need one third. Chopped dried apricot. Crush uh, caraway seeds. A little bit of salt pepper. and pepper and just uh, mix it and cook it for a few minutes you know, not now this is the orange juice and balsamic mix mixture that we have left over we just put it here one fourth cup of chopped parsley and cook this for two to three minutes okay now it's a few minutes is done we are going we are ready to transfer it to our squash you know sometimes my family just eat it like this sometimes you're lazy to cook the squash quinoa is fine we just transfer it here The roasted pumpkin seed is so yummy because of the orange and balsamic mix, uh, coating in it. Mm. <laughs> so we're not going to use it as a topping. We're just going to eat it. Are we ready to eat this? Yeah. All right. Let's try this now. Ready? Yeah. Mm. The, the squash is very easy to um, cook. I mean, well, it's soft enough. Mmm, so good. Mmm, mmm, mmm. <laughs> That's it, friends. I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope you'll make it. If you do, please let me know how you like it. All right? Don't go anywhere. Please stay tuned for our Tagalog time. Welcome to Zelvia's and Malaya's Wall of Learning. Sige, kaibigan. Tayo ay matuto! Handa na ba kayo? Ito ay hurno! 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 Ilagay ko sa hurnohan! 
gai ko sa hurnuhan. Ilagay ko ha, sa hurnuhan. It's chopstick time! Sige, ulitin natin ha. Don't forget to like.